What is up, boys? We are back here with another Yu-Gi-Oh! opening. This time we are doing the new TN 2024-10 uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! card game 25th quarter century dueling mirror. Actually, the, the product name isn't even on here. That's kind of crazy. Anyways, let's go ahead and open these up. We have a, a case, so that's 12 tins, 36 prismatic secret rares, 36 QCRs, and then 3 times 3, 9 times 12. You guys do the math. 9 times 12 ultra rares. Let's see what we can do. All right, first 10, we are in, boys. By the way, the packaging, really nice. Like, th this tin is actually really, really dope with all these um, monsters on the side. And then, of course the eternal rivals there all right so yeah three mega packs and what not so you guys heard me complain about this i'm pretty sure a lot of people have been complaining about the set pull rates are pretty crazy because there's just so many things included in here they also kind of are pulling the 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 demographic apart where they're including a lot of nostalgia bait but also a lot of meta cards but uh, yeah, you know me, I'm not really trying to pull anything meta unless it's valuable. So we're going to try to go for SP Little Knight and uh, mostly nostalgia crap. So, all right. So Realm, Eulogy, how did Die get here? Greed, Jar, Land, Flipping, a, an Ultra Rare, Daedra, Boke. Kai, what? I don't remember that card. Oh, we're starting off pretty strong here. So there are, I think, four, at least four um, alternate art variants, and this is limited removal. This is from the OCG. They got this uh, either the beginning of this year or, yeah, it was the beginning of this year. And this is awesome. I actually do want a, a lot of copies of this. I'm going to be buying a lot of these, actually, because I don't think these alternate arts are going to be printed that uh, consistently, you know, or um, we've seen Harpy's Feather Duster with the alternate art, and that wasn't reprinted that many times. I feel like that's going to be the same case here, and there we fucking go, man. I did not say which cards in particular I wanted. Wake Up Your Motherfucking Hero is definitely one of the uh, the cards that I wanted. Okay, E Purely Happiness, Ultra Rare. Let me steal a Luber, and okay, yeah, so it's, unfortunately, we only get one one prismatic secret rare and then three ultras it should have been maybe two ultras and then two prismatic secret rares so they wanted to keep the hollow ratios the way they are but it, it is what it is you know i've done enough complaining uh on the set so alpha summon a wannabe secret rare unfortunately or low dragon oh that ain't bad actually this tin is actually kind of treating me pretty well here holy Oh, man, and we're going to get a lot of cards here, so I'm trying to think the best way to keep the desk organized here because, yeah, we're going to run out of room. Click an Echo. We got Infinite Antillion, uh, something or other, Supreme King, Cybers Desaverm. I don't know, man. I don't know how to pronounce that. Evolzar Lars, Prismatic Secret Rare. Oh, I, oh, they were sticking. Please don't be damaged. Okay, good, good. We got a uh, QCR, Predator Plans, Ophiria Scorpio or something like that. Eh, I think people were complaining about that one. It's not the best pull. All right, boys, second 10 here. Uh, by the way, there is a giveaway on this video. Make sure you guys stick out through the whole the whole video because it's going to be somewhere somewhere in this video. Uh, Galaxy Summoner. We got ta Time Tearing Morgan Namite or some Toon Kingdom. All right. QCR. A Sinful something or other. A Purely Noir. By the way, I, I might be skipping a lot of these ultra rares because the ultra rares are probably not going to be that uh, good. Pre pretty much everything good is going to be in the uh, QCR or the, um, the Prismatic Seeker rare. So... It is what it is, boys. Extinguish, uh, Ultra Rare, and then we got a Junk Warrior. I don't know. Someone's got to explain to me, why is this a, a Prismatic Secret Rare? Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm confused, man. I am confused. We got uh, Phantom Knights of Silent Boots, a QCR, and then the rest here. And I'm also going to be showing you guys, once I get a pile going, of all the junk in the trunk that we got <laughs> Just opening up this goddamn product, man. Oh my god, the set size is huge. Realm, Resonance, Chaos, bitch over here. Uh, we got Imzet. Oh, we're feeling zesty today, boys. Imzesty himself. Uh, Glory of Horus. This is one of the chases. It's like 20 bucks currently. Gotta sell it as soon as possible because the price is bound to go down. 
QCR is we got a leg. Boys, I think these are, believe it or not, guys, the, the head of Exodia from last year's tins, $20 right now. Insane. I made a, a Twitter post about it. Oh, instant contact. That, ain't, that is pretty cool, actually. Wait, wasn't this printed already, though, in uh, last year's tins? No, no, I think they missed that one. Cool. Uh, but yeah, crazy ahead, bro. All right, third tin coming in hot. I had I have to be a little bit cleaner, man. It's it's gonna be such a mess here opening up this product. UFO light, manadium, rescue ace, air lifter. Oh, we got the simp punisher, boys. SP stands for simp punisher. In case you did not know, this guy, this chick is still punishing the the, the wallets of simps, essentially. This is a $40 card, guys. Holy, hopefully you pull like two, but again, the odds are not in our favor. And the QCR is first mo uh, movement solo. That is a weird one, actually. I have no, no, um, yeah, it's weird. I have nothing else to say. Uh, where are these tags right here? All right. Oh boy. We got Super Heavy, Samurai, Stealthy, Infinite, Antillion, Greed, Jar, Purely, Charlie, uh, Duelist, Genesis, Ultra Rare. Oh, dude, this tin was... Did, it, did we get Zesty Boy, SP, and the token in one tin? Wait, no, this is... Okay, this is not it. But still, an SP and a token. That is crazy. And by the way, yeah, the, you can get these tokens in Prismatic Secret Rare, guys. QCR is Torrential Tribute, unfortunately. So, you know, we can't win them all. The uh, <laughs> We got the token. We got a Sim Punisher. But we are not pulling the greatest QCRs, in my opinion. All right, we got another Stealthy Boy. We got Sinus Circuit, Amaze Attraction Thrill, Manticore Smashing, Leela Ramp, Ultra Bear, Manadium, Rim Job over here, uh, Bahumit Shark, okay, QCR, Full Armored Exceeds, uh, and then a Protection of Horrors. These Horrors, man, oh man, I really got to build a deck. All right, I feel like that last tin is definitely the tin to beat, at least in the uh, Prismatic Secret Rare front. So we'll see if we can do that. Uh, Orbit, Tenkaichi, or whatever, Galaxy, 100, Prismatic Secret Rares, and a Gigantic Champion, Sargaz, and an Ultimate, Zulkin, QCR. Okay, nice instant contact. I'll take uh, as many instant contacts, honestly. That card is really good in in Neo's decks. Um, well, it, it, it is it is and it isn't. Right now, it's kind of mediocre, we just need a a, a, lot, a little more oomph in the extra deck to actually use it. Haray, the Sword, Mikanko, Ultra Rare, Spirit of Yubel. Let's go. That is awesome to see. Although weird that it's in this set and they didn't just wait for the next one. We got a Red Gadget QCR, a Happy Guidance Horus, and a Super Heavy Security. Okay. All right. So last, last little uh, pack here. Click and Echo, Sign It Circuit. Reincarnation of Seventh Emperor Talio Spargins or Springins, uh, Tri Brigade, uh, something or other, Unchanged. Oh, that ain't bad. I don't think this is expensive currently, but it works really well with Yubel. I don't remember seeing this in the um, in the list. Uh, that's awesome. And the QCR is Guilty Gear Freed. I think this this is not uh, the best inclusion to be honest. I know it was going up in value recently, but it just ain't it. All right, fifth Mega Pack, or not Mega Pack, Tin, Kashtira, Akstara, Double Headed, Dino King Rex, Exceeds in Trust, uh, Mosea Knight, the Comet General, okay, uh, Wheel Synchron, Prismatic Secret Rare is another, t whoa, okay, we got the Yugi token and the Kaiba token. That is crazy, guys. And then the Gimmick Puppet. I, I keep forgetting that the QZ cars are literally right. <laughs> right after the friggin' Prismatic Seeger Rares, man. That is crazy. But, dude, that is awesome. Uh, I still do want the alternate art Harpy's Feather Duster and the uh, alternate art Raigeki. Raigeki especially. Man of Diem Imagining. Stake Your Soul. Okay. We got a number 32 Shark Drake. Creepy Little Punk Ultra Rare. All right, all right. I do feel like this tin in particular, or this this case in particular, at least for now, the Prismatic Seeger Rares are winning 100%. The QCRs, not so much. Uh, Mental Tuner, Loka, Samsara. Uh, we got Invasive Species, Ultra Rare. Tier Elements, Cash <laughs> Tier. That is crazy, man. This is, this is another chase for sure uh, for some people. God dang. 
All right, Chaos Ancient Gear Giant, I will take. You know, I, I did see some Ancient Gear decks top in recently, and I think that was that has like uh, OTK uh, enable enablement, so I'll take it. All right, man, come on, give me some good QCRs. I am uh, kind of bored with these QCRs. Not gonna lie, Exceeds and Trust, Manicore of Smashing, Manadium, Imaginings, Ultra Rare, Full Armored, Dark Knights, Lancer. I was just gonna say we need you, Bell. Holy man, I, I I'm calling my shots. Although I, I guess that was in my head, you Bell. I, I do need Honest as well and the Winking Karibo, but I mean you Bell for now. Another instant contact. That is an instant W right there. Hell yeah, let's go. You Bell though. Whoo, we need a couple of those. I do think this um this tin is actually gonna be fun to pick up. Like if you see it in stores, definitely pick it up. You know, gamble ten bucks or twenty bucks. Not bad. Uh, ooh, tuning. That's that's true. This is the other uh, alternate art. So it's Raigeki, Harpy's Feather Duster, Limited Removal, and Tuning. Tuning kind of looks cool, but Limited Removal has Cyber Dragon or Cyber Ultimate Dragon. Wait, hang on. Cyber Ultimate Dragon? Wait, where is it? Holy. Well, whatever it is. I, I just like it better, is what I'm trying to say. Another gadget. What? Green gadgets. The gadgets are kind of a weird inclusion. But, you know, what are you, you going to do? Konami's going to be Konami. They're going to burg out, I guess. I don't know. All right. Gigantic Thunder Cross. We got uh, some chick there. Vanguard. New Frontier. There's Arctic Polar. Star Ultra Rare. Emblema. Oath. Okay. And then our QCR is... I mean, that ain't bad. I mean... Yeah, I mean, that ain't bad. I'll, I'll take it. It's not the best, but it's also not a gadget, you know? Like, that's that's the baseline we're going for right now. All right, boys, it is giveaway time. This time it's going to be a Heretic Seal of the Heavenly Spheres QCR. It is a QCR. Don't let the lighting fool you. I put away all my lighting equipment, so sorry for the shaky cam and the shitty quality. I was like, wait, I forgot to film the giveaway portion of the video. I have to do it. I can't keep postponing it because you guys will riot. Anyway, so to be qualified for the giveaway, you have to be publicly subscribed to the channel. You have to like this video, and you must have a United States of America address so I can ship it to. And also, so I know you qualify, you know, you can read and whatnot. Um, you have to comment in this video, QCRs are now normie. I'll spell it for you guys because I actually don't know how to spell normie. I think it's I-E, right? Not, not Y. Anyways, yes, thanks, guys. The the video that, you know, this giveaway is for did a lot of traction, like 3,000 views, and that's what we're basing giveaways on. Views, not subs, because who the hell cares about subs at this point? All right, I did have to look for the limited removal, but you guys can see right there. Cyber End Dragon. That one looks better, in my opinion, compared to tuning, but I'll let you guys decide. Double-headed Dino Rex. Uh, Pendulum Moon, uh, something Orbiter, Melian, Sentry Ice, Dragon, Forge a New Future, Ultra Rare, Time Tearing, Morgamite. Actually, yeah, this was a good uh, super rare from Syak, I believe. Toon Kingdom, another Toon Kingdom, man, the repeats, the repeats, the repeats. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? There's bound to be a shit ton of repeats because, yeah, there's <laughs> so many uh, QCRs. Uh, anyway, so Branded in Central, Dogmatica, uh, the Cuckoo Commander, Exceeds and Trust, Manticore of Smashing, uh, Memesis, Elephant Ultra Rare, haven't seen that card actually, or don't remember seeing it, Junk Warrior, what? We got another Phantom Boots, I think we've seen that one already as well, a Menacing Mantis, and a Rescue Ace Preventer, so these the Rescue Ace actually are getting some... Uh, ultra rare treatments, but I don't think they've gotten any or haven't pulled any secret rares. So, I mean, that's kind of cool. They were pretty, you know, meta not that long ago. Triangle Zero, I believe. Ooh, we're getting zesty again, boys. We're getting zesty again. Hell yeah, let's go. So, it's possible to pull two zesty boys in one case. So, maybe two Sim Punishers in the case and another wait is this the same goddamn leg i mean i'm not complaining because we just pulled a zesty boy but it's also kind of weird that there's so many qcrs and we keep pulling doubles like look at this what anyways you guys will definitely be the judge of this opening but i do feel like the prismatic seeker rares are there's just better pulls there tally ho small scuffle ultra rare startling stare of the snake guys 
All right, Tira, another cash Tira. Holy man, we've seen this before. The Seal of Orichalcos. All right, all right. Yeah, I'm kind of iffy on this too. I understand it. it you know, it's it's all right actually. It's kind of decent. It's uh, not a good card. Like they should make just a an Orichalcos archetype at this point. Um, but yeah, it, it is what it is. Like in a mega pack, I don't think it should have been printed, but as a QCR print, I understand. I understand. Manadium, Breakheart, Galaxy, Summons, Ultra Rare, Cashiro, Riceheart. Whoa, okay. And a Relinquished Anima. Okay, now, now we're seeing something different, and this is actually a de decent pull as well, in my opinion. So, also one of my favorite cards, believe it or not. I, I don't know why I like it. I started using him in, in a Sacred Beast deck, like, I don't know, one or two years ago. And I was like, why is no one using this in decks? Like, it's a better Link Karibo. And now that Link Karibo was banned, people are like, oh my god, it's so good. Because, you know, it is what it is. Yvonzar Leos, uh, Despian, Lula, 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 what? Lulu Lemon will go with a Gazelle over here. QCR, Melfi, Hide and Seek, a TG Rocket, Salamander. Ultra rare, and then the rest there. We are winding down, so let's you know let's power through this. There's a lot of stuff to open. This this is why I hate mega packs, by the way, and I've hated them for such a long time. Because there's so much crap. There's so much crap on my floor right now. I might actually show that <laughs> just to prove the point. I guess we got Cosmic Blazar Dragon. This is pretty cool. I will take that one actually. Manadium Fearless, purely. And the rest there. So I I forgot. Yes, Blue Eyes and Dark Magician. We need to pull those. And definitely the Alt Art Dark Magician girl. Because why not? <laughs> why the hell not? It is a waifu. Uh, purely Charlie. Cyber's uh, Decev, Decev Wave form or something like that. Snake Guy Ash. Holy. Uh, yellow Gadget. I mean, we completed the gadgets. We got yellow, red, and green. Uh, not sure what that'll, you know, that, that, that means nothing. <laughs> I can't believe they have printed the gadgets, man. Like, it really, the, the limbs of Exodia actually make sense to me, but the gadgets, not so much. Uh, New Frontier, got an Earthbound Prisoner, a Center Ion Leg Legatia, and another Ancient Gear Giant. All right. Purely Sleepy Memory, Ultra Rare, and Starring Night. Oh, those got reprinted, huh? Okay. It really does feel like the first half of this keys was, like, way better. Let me know, too, if you guys feel that way. Exceeds and Trust, Manticore of Smashing, Galaxy, Summoner, Tier Elements, Cash Tier, another one. Holy, I hope this is still valuable. And we got a Galaxy Eyes Cypher, Cypher Dragon, E Purely Happiness. All right, all right. Come on, give, give me that. At least the blue eyes, man. I feel like the blue eyes is going to be kind of valuable in a couple years, and I don't want to buy it. I'm probably buying a shit ton, but I don't want to buy at least one. Like, I want to remember pulling a blue eyes from this set. Gishki uh, Grimness. It's What the hell? It has like a whole bunch of shit on here. That's crazy. Infernal Flame Banishy. Uh, Prismatic Secret Rare. Parallel Exceed. All right, all right, I see you. This one also, okay, no, that's the stamp. I was going to say, there's a lot of, like, um, cards with, with glue, essentially, on them, and I do not like that. I, I prefer my cards mint out of the pack there, Konami, or at least close to, not with some some uh, machine jizz on it. Talio Springens, or How Ray the Sword Mikanko. God damn, this, okay, the Prismatic Series are really... Like, goddamn bonfire, bro? That is crazy. And, okay, that's another one I, I wanted. Light and Darkness. Dragon. This, I mean, I don't know how you guys feel, but this this is, like, amazing. An amazing reprint, especially as a QCR. Usually they forget cards like that, and I'm glad they did not forget my boy. All right, boy, second to last. Ten here. Come on, man. I'm kind of losing hope that we're going to pull the Blue Eyes or the Alt Art Dark Magician Girl or the Alt Art Red Eyes. Um, but we got to keep hoping here. St uh, Stare of the Snake Eyes, Kashtira, Right Heart, and what is this? It's a spell. Another Seal of Orichalcos. Ooh, you hate to see it. You hate to see it, bo boys. Oh, my God. I was going to say bro. <laughs> you hate to see it, bro. Oh, man. Photon, Time Stomp, uh, Intimidating Ore, 
a Synchro World, Manadium Breakheart, Galaxy Summoner, Prismatic Secret Rare is... I saw Synchro, and I was like, God damn it, is it, is it another Junk Warrior? At least it's not. All right, what is this? That's another... Oh, it's a Link. Okay, that's that's decent. I'll, I'd rather get more Relinquished Animas than Seal of Ori Calicos any day. Although, I don't know long-term. Maybe Seal of Ori Calicos might do uh, pretty decent long-term. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm iffy on that one, actually. Uh, Realm, Eulogy, Italio, Springens, Supreme King, Dragon, Lu uh, Light, Lightworm, Soul of the Supreme King, and Favorite Contact. I mean, as a hero player, I, I, I will take that, actually. Uh, yeah, I will take that. I forgot to do, uh, I forgot to, uh, you know, build this up. Tyrant, Red Dragon, Archfiend. I'll take it. The dragons do look all the dragons, the, the 5Ds dragons do look pretty nice because they're synchro. Synchro cards look really good in QCRs. All right, last, last tin here. Come on. I know. I pulled a Sin Punisher. I pulled two tokens. I need, I need blue eyes. I need it. I need it. Now, we've been pulling a lot of blue eyes recently too. So I feel like Kaiba, I am, I am the incarnation of Kaiba here. Evolsar. Leos, we got a Gravekeeper's in in Inscription. Not a bad card, honestly. And it is... Ah, oh, Gazelle. Not the King of Mythical Beasts, but... Uh, oh, boy. All right. All right, all right. I, I, at first, I was like, it could be Dark Magician Girl, though, because that is also a QCR. But it's a god dang Gazelle there. That's unfortunate. All right, New Frontier, Orbit... Ushara King, what is our uh, prismatic here? Sim Punisher? Ooh, I was like, come on, man, come on, man. Give me one more Sim Punisher. You gotta punish them Sims. All right, what is this? Come on, normal monster. Oh, uh, wait, what the attribute is? Win Terror Top. It's Terror Top. Oh, I got you baited. I do want a Terror Top, though. Really cheap, by the way, surprisingly. The ulti Terror Top was fetching a lot of money. Not that long ago. And a QCR is like two bucks. Like, dude, that is like my investment senses are tingling on that one. Uh, we got Kaime, uh, Amaze Attraction Thrill, Ginkin Ship, Shari Red Ultra. And it is what? Dude, these ultra rare, these uh, prismatic secret rares, I mean, insane, bro. Insane. All right, last QCR here is a... Okay, I, I will take that one. I'll take it. Oh, man. Okay, so, I mean, we powered through this, guys. I, I okay, Honest opinion, if these are the pull rates... Because, again, I only watched Cyber Knight's video, and that was the pre-release, so I think you only opened, like, two tins. I haven't seen any uh, other openings. If the pull rates are like this, where it's, like, kind of crappy, but you do get value back... I am going to buy another case. There's also, by the way, a lot of people have been saying that there's a lot of um, of uh, misprints. I didn't see anything here from what I remember, but I might buy another tin, another case for that as well. You guys can see here. I mean, these are my favorites. Uh, QCRs, let's do a quick recap. Why the hell not? Actually, you know what? Let's pull all the QCRs out because I kind of forgot. I know we saw some doubles, uh, quite a bit of doubles, <laughs> if I'm going to be honest. And yeah, so there should be 36 QCRs. Look at that. Look at how how common QCRs now are, man. Green gadgets, yellow gadget, of course, red gadget, so we complete the gadgets. Bahumet Shark, uh, Ultimate Zulkin. I like this, by the way. Torrential Tribute, weird print. First movement solo, again, really weird. See, here, here's the thing. Here's my problem with the printing of uh, of traps, uh, spells and traps, right? They don't look cool. Like, this is just water, and this is just a book with, like, a rod or some shit. I don't know. This might be, like, a music thing. Um, they just don't look cool. But then if you look at, at monsters, it's a freaking dragon. That is awesome. That's my problem with printing uh, high rarity spells and traps. Or low dragon, Toon Kingdom, a Scorpio dude, Parallel Exceed, a gazelle, a Cyber Dragon, Giant Grinder, a something boots. These cards are really hard to read too. It's the Seal of Ori Calcos, uh, Parallel Exceed, Chaos Ancient Gear, uh, Gazelle, another Seal, another Boots, another Kingdom. So now we're seeing the repeats, another uh, Giant. Uh, 32 shark 
a Steel Knight, a Winked Dragon, or Black Black Winged Dragon. Wait, yeah, black, it's so hard to read, dude. You Bell, uh, what's his, what's his face? Uh, and another what's his face? Light and Darkness Dragon. I, it's, again, I'm trying to read it, and I, I like trying to recall it from memory, guys. I think we got two relinquished animas actually, and Cosmic Blazar Dragon. A, another left leg or whatever. And then, of course, the boy. This is the first QCR we pulled. Wake up, your motherfucking hero. And then the Prismatic Secret Rares. I'm not going to do all of them because this video is already way too long. But, dude, the Prismatic Secret Rares did save this opening, I feel. Um, okay, so we got... I kept some of the better ones, you know, my favorites, and definitely the more higher fire value ones to the side here. So we got Tuning Alt Arts. We got Token, Kaiba Token, Limited Removal, Altar, Chaos Angel, Favorite Contact, Bonfire, Dude, Crazy. Uh, tier Elements, Cash Tira, Center Ion, Snake Eye Ash, Rise Hearts, uh, Zesty Boy, Tier Elements, Cash Tira again, a Yugi Token, Unchained Sword, Soul Sword of Soul Lord of Yama, uh, Sim Punisher, hell yeah, another Zest, the other Zesty Boy. And Spirit of Yubel. So you guys let me know. I feel like they, the, definitely the Prismatic Secret Rares killed it. And let me also know what you guys pulled. Because, again, if these are the pull rates and you get some value back and then you get some collectibles on the side, I might switch my opinion on this set. But, again, the set size is too big and they could have definitely changed that. Catch you guys in the next one. A big thank you to the one and only channel member, Eric. I hope... I keep pulling acceptable waifus that we can bond over, man.